This is an example of a boundary that doesn't work. I've asked you to stop speaking to me that way. I Please lower your voice. I am not going to lower my voice. I was very clear about that. I was very clear about how I feel. I'm angry and now you're telling me how to speak? I get that you're angry. I've asked you numerous times to stop raising your voice. You keep raising it higher. Please speak to me in a rational tone. You want me to be rational? You want, now you want me to be rational. You come home, you pick a fucking fight with me and now you want me to be rational. I didn't come home and pick a fight with you. I asked you if you wanted to get dinner with me and my friend. That's all that happened. It's a clear no. I'm asking you to please stop yelling at me. I would like to feel better before I leave. I'm sorry. I didn't know this was going to upset you. You didn't know this was going to upset me. I had a long day. It is Thursday. I like, why would you think I would even want to go out? But now you have to just guilt trip me. Like, Go, like, why do I need to go with you to go out with your friend? That's, that's not what happened. Please keep your voice down. I came home. I told you, Linda, at, just texted me, asked me if I want to get dinner, and I asked if you wanted to come. It's very clear you don't want to. I'm going to leave in a few minutes. Can we please just, like, I would like to leave on a good note. I don't want to be sitting at dinner upset. So now I'm responsible for your feelings again. So you're going to be upset at dinner. I'm sure you're going to complain about me. I don't even like Linda. I don't even under, like, it's, it's always about your fucking feelings. Okay, okay. I, 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 I don't think I'm in a place to go anymore. I'm just going to text her and tell her I'm not going. I, I'm really sorry that I upset you. I will not, I won't ask. I, I, I'm not going to ask again. What doesn't work? is that you're not removing yourself from the harm. That conversation can continue for hours because then after you choose not to go, they're gonna hold it against you that you didn't go because now they might feel guilty and they don't wanna feel that guilt or shame so that will be continuously used against you. Here's an example of what does work. This is fucking bullshit. You knew, like, I come home from work and you just make me so mad. I literally just asked you if you wanted to go for dinner. I did not expect a 30 minute conversation about this. I'm sorry. I understand you're tired, but can you please stop speaking to me that way? What you, I, I need to speak to you the way that you want to be spoken to. Like, what do you want me to do? This doesn't need to be a fight. I'm going out to dinner. I've asked you to stop yelling at me. If you yell at me again, I'm going to leave. Here we go. I'm the fucking bad guy again. Cause you can't handle feelings.